Welcome to Solar Basics. I'm Kelsey Misbrenner, Senior Editor of Solar Power World. And I'm Billy Lute, Associate Editor. Flush mount solar systems are increasingly getting closer to the roof for the sleekest look possible. But one thing that's sometimes overlooked when designing the most attractive system is just how to manage all the wires underneath. There isn't a blanket method for proper wire management on rooftop solar projects. How to secure PV cables depends on the racking system, modules, and the type of roof covering on the building. Most solar racking and mounting manufacturers carry products specific to wire management, and companies like Hellerman Titan and Burndy have a range of clips and ties for securing solar cables, but this specialized equipment is often overlooked for a cheaper alternative. The common solution for securing wire on a flush-mounted array is simple plastic zip ties bought from any home improvement store. These cable ties are inexpensive and neither solar rated nor UL certified to withstand the vast temperature changes underneath a residential solar system over its operating lifespan. Only plastic ties that are tested for prolonged exposure to sunlight, extreme temperature changes, and vibrations should be used on solar projects. Whether to use metal clips or plastic cable ties depends on site conditions and installer preference. Metal clips are stronger and have a longer lifespan, but they can have sharper edges that can cut into components if secured incorrectly, including into the PV wiring itself. Certain rail-based solar mounts are designed to work with accessory wire clamps. Then there are clip-free cabling solutions like Unirac's Solar Tray, a wiring channel that clicks onto the racking rail and runs the length of the module, supporting the entire length of cable. While low-grade zip ties are a problem, improper installation practices with any wire management solution can also be detrimental. If an installer is using plastic or metal ties, they can't be pulled too tightly around the wire. Otherwise, the cable will expand in the heat and cause the tie to break. If using clips or ties for routing wires, the cable can't be so slack that it's touching the roof, nor can it be too tight like a guitar string. Above all, solar installers should set down that cheap bag of plastic zip ties and consult mounting companies or wire management manufacturers to ensure their arrays don't have future cable issues. For more on mounting solar projects, read our story online and stay tuned to the next Solar Basics videos. Thank you.